Have you ever seen fried fish that looks like a sponge? Look at this, you guys. That is some of the crispiest fried fish you'll ever have in your life. Check out how I made it. So the first thing we're gonna do is make our batter. This is a wet batter. We're starting out with one cup of cornstarch. Then you're gonna need one cup of regular old all-purpose flour. One big tablespoon of some baking powder. I'm gonna add a healthy portion of some garlic salt. And then we're gonna open the top on the Dano seasoning. That's the blue top. We're gonna add a bunch of that in there. Now we're gonna go in with some Oktoberfest. We used about half. And now it's time for the main ingredient. We're using vodka. And yes, I'm using the super cheap vodka. I'm gonna go in with one cup. What this does is the alcohol evaporates super quick when it goes into the oil. So it leaves all these little air bubbles in the crust. And that's what makes it super crispy. So one cup of vodka. After you give it a good whisking, you can see it's kind of like a pancake batter. So now we're just gonna throw this into our fridge for about 20 minutes, let it thicken up a little bit. All right, so it's been about 20 minutes. You can see our batter has thickened up a bit. So now it's time to cut up our fish, get it battered. So first we're gonna heat up our oil. We got a peanut oil in here. We're gonna heat it up to 375 degrees. We're gonna take the large piece of the loin. We're just gonna cut it off right there, just like that. We're gonna cut this little tip off. So here is one of our nice pieces of fish. Then we're gonna cut the loin in half at an angle. So we got three really nice pieces of fish. This one's my favorite. Grab the Dano seasoning, that's the blue top, and we're gonna sprinkle generously. Flip them over, get a little more on there, pat it in. Now I'll get you a big spoon. We'll get some of our all-purpose flour. We're just gonna sprinkle it right on top. All right, now your fish should look like that. Now we're gonna go straight into our batter. Just like that. That's what we're looking for. 375, that's right where we wanna be. Time to fry. Just let that batter kind of drip off of there. Now we're ready. Back and forth, slowly, slowly. There we go. Now here's a little trick. Get you a big scoop of the batter and go back and forth right on top of the fish. Look at that, y'all. Wow. A clip. All right, my friends. It has been six or seven minutes. That bad boy is done. Look at that. Let's go in with our other pieces. Carefully, we go in. All right, so check this out. I'm going to scoop out some of these crusties off the top. I've only been in there for a minute or two, but look how it looks like a sponge. As soon as it hits that oil, that vodka wants to evaporate, so that's what leaves this so crispy and airy and fluffy. <laughs> Look at that, you guys. Perfect. Wow. Look how that just falls apart. So crispy. You can knock all that off, get straight down to the meat. Definitely the best fried fish I've ever made or had, I don't even know what to say right now. I'm kind of speechless. Now all we're missing is a cocktail sauce or something, but I'll leave that up to you guys. You need to try this, yum yum, get you some.